My name is Dr. Frank Njenga and I'm a consultant psychiatrist uh, here to, to talk about uh, mental health in the COVID-19 era in collaboration with Britain. The first uh, reaction to normal human beings is a sense of fear, worry, anxiety, stress. And that I would like to emphasize is a normal response that is elicited by normal people in a new, novel, dangerous and worrying um, environment. The consequence of excessive worry and anxiety um, is manifold and uh, some people uh, are unable to sleep, for example, uh, others lose appetite, others become irritable and angry more easily than usual. Normal people faced by a pandemic behave in a way that is unusual but acceptable. The way to take uh, care of particular uh, mental health is first of all to remain informed. Once you have informed yourself from a reliable source, then there are a number of things that you can then be able to do uh, yourself. For example, the, the effect of the pandemic is that it, is, it destroys routine. It makes us stay at home. It makes us spend too much time um, doing very little, watching videos and, um, and things like that. So the first thing that you need to do after you have informed yourself is to ensure that you have a routine. Go to bed at an appointed time, wake up at an appointed time, and make sure that your life has a measure of regularity and routine. The second thing is to keep yourself clean. There are a lot of people during this pandemic stay in bed from night until morning and then the whole day, and perhaps because of the anxiety and worry, they even forget about looking after their own personal uh, hygiene. The next thing is that because you're at home on the couch, uh, you eat badly uh, and you're snacking uh, all day. It's very important that families uh, take appropriate measures to make sure that they eat uh, healthy food, including fruits and vegetables and so on. All this sounds common sense, but I think it is important because it contributes uh, to your mental health as well. I cannot overemphasize the importance and significance of exercise. A lot of people think that exercise is for the body. Yes, it is for the body, but it's also critical um, to the mind. Find time to do something interesting. Find something that you enjoy doing. If you enjoy reading, read. If you enjoy praying, pray. If you enjoy talking to your relatives, call them and talk to them. But for goodness sake, this is not the end of the world and you must find something that is enjoyable to yourself to do even as we ride this crest. Britam, with you every step of the way.